Thursday, it's Thursday, it's Thursday. Good morning, good morning, Lisa here. This is Lisa 6 and 3, and here is God's strength for you this day. Our scripture reading is coming from Mark 11. It's kind of long, but it's good stuff. Here we go. We're going to start at uh, verse 20. Now in the morning, as they passed by, they saw the fig tree dried up from the roots. And Peter, and, and Peter, remembering, said to him, Rabbi, look, the fig tree which you cursed has withered away. So Jesus answered and said to them, Have faith in God. For surely I say to you, whoever says to this mountain, be removed and be cast into the sea, and does not doubt in his heart, but believes that those things he says will be done, he will have whatever he says. Therefore, I say to you, whatever things you ask when you pray, believe that you receive them and you will have them. And whenever you stand praying, if you have anything against anyone, forgive him that your Father in heaven may also forgive you your trespasses. But if you do not forgive, neither will your Father in heaven forgive your trespasses. <laughs> I know this is a scripture that we've been reading for decades, in the centuries in the church, um, in the body of Christ, in the truth of the Lord. But um, when I read this scripture this morning, it just, it, it just did something... Um, it did something to me. It was another light bulb here. He says, Don't doubt in your heart. When you stand and pray, forgive. <laughs> Be a believer. Have faith in God. When you pray. My message to us today is have faith when you pray without grudging so if you are hold, holding harboring some unforgiveness in your heart uh, you've been mean to somebody <laughs> and you need to ask for forgiveness or you just need to say I forgive you for whatever it may be y'all there is condition to this whole life as a Christian we you know, salvation is free Jesus died on the cross on the cross. We pay no price for it. However, there is a price we have to pay here on earth to get all of this stuff that's in this Bible. <laughs> we gotta have faith. Do you have enough faith to believe that God can and will do it for you? Do you have enough faith when you pray? making sure you don't have any ill feelings and holding grudges to anybody. Perhaps that's why your prayers haven't been answered. You're still holding on to some stuff that you don't have faith enough to believe that God can deliver you from. I know I went on a tangent this morning, but that's some good stuff. That really ministered to me. I think I probably need to make a phone call. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm still doing my work. I'm still trying to find peace in peace with them uh, that was good stuff hey this has been Lisa with Lisa 63 remember remember when you pray and believe in your heart don't have grudges of people about um, toward people God will hear your prayers now go make it a wonderful day and I will see you in the morning be blessed